I see that the real Max is back. So how was your time trip, dude? Shut up. Oh, you're alive. You're alive. Oh, both of us. I did so much to bring you back home. It worked. It actually worked. You're with me again. It looks like even fate doesn't want us apart. And I traveled through multiple realities just to save my ungrateful ass over and over. And I hope it was worth it. I don't blame you for wanting me out of your life after all my drama. Come on. I'm the official drama king and queen of Arcadia Bay this week. Just look at what my powers have caused in just a short time. Nobody. You're Max fucking Caulfield, time warrior. Even if you weren't, you're kind and caring. Nobody could have a better best friend. No. You didn't ask for any of this to happen, but it did. You need to accept how awesome you are. Maybe I will something. I always wanted my life to be special and adventure. But not without you. And it, it didn't happen until I moved back here. So without you, my powers wouldn't even exist. And for whatever scientific, mystical reason that will obviously never fail, we were meant to be together at this exact moment in history. I have to think that Rachel was somewhere behind the scenes fighting for justice. I'd like to think that too. We all owe Rachel Amber. Now tell me everything that happened. You, you remember, right? Well, we we left the party and made sure Jefferson couldn't find us. For once, I was glad I lived in an actual fortress. And the storm got hella crazy, and, and you said we would be safe in the lightness. Chloe, look. The storm is getting bigger now. It's coming closer. Oh, I, I can't even believe this is real. This is happening because of me. Stop it. This is stop beating yourself up, okay? We both paid our dues how many of it. The lighthouse is out of the way of the tornado. Come on. What? Chloe. I've got to go back. Whoa. Alfred Hitchcock famously called film Little Pieces of Time. I I'm back in class. The photography as like the what the hell? These pieces of time can frame us in our glory. I have to listen to this Jefferson lecture again. This might be hell. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer okay, who perfectly captured the human condition in black and white? Am I stuck in a time loop? Anybody? Bueller? Diane Arbus. Be calm. There you go, Don't Gloria. freak out. Why Arbus? Yet. Because of her images of hopeless faces. I feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as torture. What's going on? Nobody even cares. She's like, Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Everybody's gone now. Have I totally fucked up time? This doesn't make sense. Not yet, you bastard. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I just wanted to know if you'd like to spend the rest of your life in my dark room. Your purity inspires me so much, and we can be so happy together. Who needs selfies when I can give you portraiture? There's no my selfies are shit. I need to be framed by a real artist. I'm just a poser. Yes, you will be posing for me. There's so many angles I want to expose you with to the world. I hope you don't mind needles or duct tape. This can't be real. I don't believe it. Hey, Kate. Max, how could you let me jump off a roof? You were the only person I trusted here. But you never really listened to me. Now I'm never going to heaven. Instead, you've stuck me in hell. Alone forever. No! Kate, I, I was only trying to save you.
request you to chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? I am. When your mom's away. I'll let her know that. Hello? Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Matt. We're all going to work with two wins. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come and give you one. Now I'll have an excuse to get a poke. Be there shortly. Love you. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the safe mart. She don't have many bags of delicious growth for us. You are ridiculous. Home. You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Shit, where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar. You're bankrupting me. Aha. You can't hide from me forever. Now lock up after I leave. Play nice. Try not to destroy too much of the house. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting set. Dad, 